In a case that was eventually dropped, Meghan Markle was charged with planning a plot to damage someone's reputation. Hello, before we go any further, kindly subscribe to the channel for more news about the British royal family. In a stunning turn of events, Meghan Markle's defamation lawsuit was summarily dismissed from court, making her the winner of her legal struggle. This victory hasn't, however, been without its share of allegations. Meghan's half-sister Samantha Markle has publicly declared that the Duchess planned a clever slander campaign against her. In the early months of 2022, Samantha sued Meghan for defamation, which is how the story started. According to her, Meghan damaged her reputation by giving private information to the unapproved biography, Finding Freedom. Moreover, Samantha contended that Meghan had further tarnished her reputation by talking about their turbulent relationship in an interview with the legendary Oprah Winfrey. Samantha's complaints, however, did not stop there. Additionally, she drew criticism for Meghan and Harry's widely reported documentary series, which debuted in December of that same year on the massive streaming service Netflix. Samantha asserted that this series served only as a platform for the spread of harmful, hurtful, and malevolent misinformation. She claimed that Meghan set out to malign her, portraying her as a dishonest liar and attention seeker. In the court filings, Samantha revealed something shocking. She claimed that the half sister's relationship had soured as a result of Meghan's trip with Prince Harry, which finally caused them to become estranged. Samantha further claimed that Meghan showed a callous disdain for their relationship in 2017 and 2018. Samantha was left feeling humiliated and alienated when Meghan abruptly ended a phone call, according to her, and astonishingly only invited their mother to the opulence of the royal wedding. Meghan and Harry started a romantic adventure in 2016, and their love grew like a bright flower in full bloom. The pinnacle of their relationship was reached in May 2018 when they married in a lavish, nationally broadcast ceremony held in the picturesque town of Windsor. But with all the glitz and festivity, Meghan's family was conspicuously absent, with the exception of her loving mother, Doria Ragland. The court filings state that Samantha, Meghan's estranged half-sister, appeared out of nowhere in the public eye, perhaps manipulated by the media's voracious hunger for scandal. She said in an interview that Meghan had cruelly disregarded their father after his terrifying experience of suffering two heart attacks. Ever ready to conjure up stories of mystery, the media contrived a web of lies, using made-up comments to claim Samantha had attacked Meghan brutally. Due to the weight of these unfounded charges, Meghan allegedly started a campaign to damage Samantha's reputation, which fueled their developing animosity. But now that the lawsuit has concluded, a clear victory has been rendered. Samantha is unable to make her allegations again. Meghan's move to have her case dismissed for failing to establish a claim was granted by Judge Honeywell, who wisely said so. Consequently, Samantha's allegations of defamation and defamation by implication were rejected with bias, permanently eliminating any possibility of their resuscitation. The clerk was told to record a judgment in favor of Meghan Markle, who is better known as Meghan the Duchess of Sussex, as the gavel of justice rang out. All outstanding motions were dismissed with this final decision, and the matter was ceremoniously concluded, leaving a trail of dashed hopes and severed relationships in its wake. I appreciate you staying until the very end. For further updates, don't forget to subscribe to the channel and feel free to leave your comments below.